This tutorial will explain the difference between users and extensions on the FreedomIQ system. To get started, we can log into Weblink by going to freedomvoice.com or freedomiq.com and clicking login in the top right corner. Once we are logged in to the Weblink online control panel, if we mouse over the settings tab, we can see two sections, users and extensions. Users are essentially an account that is created to allow you to log into Weblink. Extensions are actual physical extensions that are accessible from the auto attendant. So the Freedom IQ system in particular comes with extensions 8.0 through 8.9 and extensions 800 through 8.04. Now as you activate, you, you can add extensions during the activation process if you run out of extensions. Users are typically assigned to an extension and that is for purposes of activating a phone, um, having it for their personal voicemail, those sorts of things. But it is not necessary to actually have an administrative user assigned to an extension as we can see here. So this is a user but they don't actually take up an extension. And that would be in the case of an admin who needed to log in and maybe pay the bill, change account info, review reports, but didn't actually need to log in to change any settings. Maybe they didn't have a phone on their desk, that sort of thing. And they didn't actually need a voicemail on the system. Now when a user gets assigned to extend an extension, it typically means they have to access an extension for voicemail or for their call forward settings to update those sorts of things and to have calls forwarded to their phones. Now if we look at the extensions list here again, we will notice that we cannot rename extensions that are assigned to a user because they automatically inherit the username, where extensions that are not assigned to a user are available for any type of use. So we can rename extension 83 here, for example, to just you know, play company information or whatever we'd like to set it up for. And we can see the existing examples of 80 for the operator, 81 for sales, and 82 for support. So users and extensions are typically two different things, but they are often related. Thank you for watching this tutorial.